five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition. And lift off. Vehicle is pitching downrange. Stage one, chamber pressure is nominal. see Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from Cape Canaveral Space Force Station, carrying our stack of Starlink satellites into orbit. There we just heard that power and telemetry are all nominal. We're going to throttle the engines down in preparation for max Q. And this is the largest, this is the largest structural load that the vehicle will see during ascent. So slowing the vehicle down a little helps during that short period. Max Q coming up here in just a couple of seconds. Q. There we heard the call out for Max Q. Now, over in, the, in about a minute, the next three events will be happening back to back. First, we have main engine cutoff or MECO, and that's where all nine of the M1D engines that are currently firing will shut down. And this will help slow the vehicle down in preparation for stage separation, which is event number two. Stage and, one is following a nominal trajectory. And as the name suggests, Stage step is where the first and second stages will separate from each other. And the first stage will start to make its way back down to Earth for landing on our drone ship. While second stage continues its journey with the third event, uh, SCS-1 or second engine start one. This is where the MVAC engine will light up and begin to propel the second stage along with those Starlink satellites to orbit. And that main engine cutoff event is taking place in about 10 seconds. Great shot there of the vehicle prior to Miko. Main engine cutoff. Stage separation confirmed. All right, all three of those events happening in quick succession prior to MVAC ignition there that you see caught a glimpse of. Oh, and on the left-hand side of your screen, you can see the Space Coast illuminated by the night lights. That's an awesome shot there as we see the grid fins beginning their deployment. So everything